My project is an open source method for training and deploying neural networks onto microcontrollers. It's written entirely in C++ with as minimal dependencies as possible, and it's designed to be lightweight and easy to deploy for any number of applications. Uh, it's written for generalized purposes. Currently, it's doing inverse joint kinematics for a robotic arm. The project showcase has been a, a great opportunity um, both to see everyone uh, else's work and as well as to be able to show off my own stuff. Today, I have had the opportunity to meet uh, multiple people in the industry. Um, all of them have seemed very interested in my project, which was uh, a great relief as uh, the nature of my project is quite niche and I was curious about the actual industry applications of it. Um, but being able to chat with these uh, people from industry has kind of reassured me and also uh, given me ideas to take this project on further. I think my placement has greatly increased my employability. Uh, employers always look for experience and kind of having um, such a big name as Intel on my CV is almost like acting like a check mark, you know, uh, like the, yeah, that I've been vetted almost by a large company. Um, and as well as that, the soft skills that I've learned and just uh, like generally how to kind of like sell my skills properly um, has been a huge benefit in looking for uh, postgrad opportunities. I think uh, as part of our degree that we are very much allowed to pursue whatever we like. Um, uh, a lot of us here have very different interests. It, uh, engineering and robotics especially is a very, very large field. And so I kind of decided what I was going to do and I was given the resources and given the, the, the supervisor that could best help me. Um, I think the uni is very, very good at sort of encouraging us to uh, pursue exactly what we'd like to do. So I uh, attended PAL sessions in my first year. Um, coming from uh, straight from A-levels without like a gap year, I was uh, a little bit unprepared uh, for uni and sort of like the change in teaching styles. The content I was okay with, but it was sort of the, the, the much bigger emphasis on like self-guided learning and was something I initially struggled with. So I attended these PAL sessions with these uh, second and third year students and they were a massive benefit. And then going into second year, I applied to be a PAL student myself to try and hope to almost give something back and, and, and do the same thing that uh, other first year students who are in my shoes. My advice for any prospective students would be to make the most of the support that uni gives you. There's uh, resources for sort of any issue that you could uh, encounter, whether it's student life related issues, issues of accommodation or housing. And as well as that, um, we have things like the Writing Cafe and other initiatives to help with academic writing and things that students may not have encountered before coming to uni. 